Welcome to the Bearded Barbarian! Welcome, everybody. Today is Mystery Box Day. Oh, yes, Mystery Box. We got a couple other boxes, one from FYE. We've got one from Deep Discount. And yes, as I mentioned, we got a cool Mystery Box. Now, uh, full disclosure, this Mystery Box has been sitting in my pile for quite some time. Many, many, many months. I believe sometime in August I purchased this. I didn't mean to leave it in the pile that long. Sometimes when things get put in the bottom, that's where they end up. So I've been digging through and trying to get some of that stuff pulled out. So this particular mystery box is from DS Funko, okay? It's been sitting so long, he's changed his name on Instagram to Flimsy Funkos. Regardless, I'll make sure to go ahead and put the information down below, the link to his Instagram. I believe he's got a new mystery box actually up there now. Um, so, you know, go ahead and check it out and hopefully... Find some good stuff. So I'm a little nervous about this mystery box, mainly because because it's been sitting so long, um, the prices may have fluctuated significantly. But we're going to see what it is, and hopefully we find something pretty cool in here. So this particular mystery box is a $50 mystery box. There is a $10 shipping that I paid, and the top pull is Funky Phantom, which is a thousand piece item. So there's some other cool stuff too. I'll make sure to put the picture up in the corner. Um, above so you can take a look and see what other type of options there are. So there were 25 boxes in this run, so it was a pretty short run type of situation. I believe at that time that this may have been his first mystery box, so we'll see how that turns out. So hopefully we got something really good in here. We can get a chance to check it out. And again, like I mentioned, we have a couple more things. We've got our um, FYE box, and then we've got a big box from Deep Discount. So because it's a mystery box, we're going to go ahead and Try our jelly bean, try our luck, get our jelly beans, and see if we can find something tasty or not so tasty in this regard. All right, let's see what we got. Got a green one. That usually means bad news. That's not too bad. Tastes kind of melony. I don't know if it's a honeydew or I'm not sure the green one's a honeydew or or what other I don't know some kind of melon. Oh, it tastes like me. Not bad though. Doesn't taste like a booger, so that's always a good thing. All right, let's go ahead and crack into this Fye box and see what we found. No idea what it is. No idea. All right. So hopefully it's packed well. FYE, FYE usually does a good job of packing. Ah, yes, we found ourselves a, another uh, Minions Pop. I planned on opening these before Halloween, but since, again, they've been shuffled in the bottom of the pile, um, that's what happened. So this is Bride Kevin. So this is uh, Kevin dry, dressed up as the Bride of Frankenstein. It's a cool one. I like this one. So yeah, I like the Minion ones. I haven't gotten all of the Minion ones, but I've gotten a number of them, and they're, they're a lot of fun. So hopefully you like that one. Bride Kevin. All right, let's take a look at our deep discount. I haven't bought that much from them recently, but in the past I had been buying quite a bit of things from them. I've, I've always had pretty good luck, which I think is good. Um, usually they do a decent job. The only thing, you know, time when it's, uh, a concern is maybe they don't pack it very um, tight, but I haven't had any damage pop, so that's always a good thing. What do we get? We got us a Maleficent pop. Maleficent. This is the six-inch style. It's with her and her throne that looks like wings, and it also has a little dude sitting up on the wings. It's hard to see inside there. Stay tuned at the end for this one and this one and our pops that we have in our mystery box on our spinner, and you get a chance to really get a good view of what they look like out of the box. So this one's a really cool one. I actually gave this one to uh, Geeking Out with Melly Mel uh, for our Funko Ween. Um, so if you, I'll make sure to put a link up above so you can go over and check her channel out and see the, the pops that I gave her. This was one of the ones as well. She actually dressed up as Maleficent, which I thought was really cool. Just happenstance that she decided to dress up and I also gave her Maleficent. But I thought it was so cool, I wanted one myself. So... Anyway, so I thought that was neat. All right, so those are those two. Let's see, take a look and see what we got in our mystery box. I'm not sure, again, how many are in here. Cup two, three, whatever. But uh, hopefully it's going to be... Is that 
he taped it up real good, I can tell you that. So, all right. So I'm going to just try to reach around mystery box style and poke around and see what I can find. I'll try not to look. See how it's packed. All right. I don't want to move too much around here. I feel a couple sorters, maybe? I'm not sure. I feel like there's a hard stack here. I feel like we may have a hard stack. We may have a sorter, so it feels like two pops. Let's check it out and see what we got. I'll go ahead and pull the sorter out first. Let's see what we got. So two pops, one in a sorter and one in a hard stack. Let's see what we got here. Ah, yes, we got a biggie. Notorious B.I.G. He is in his, looks like a basketball jersey style. He's got his microphone in there. It's a cool one. I have a Tupac, but I don't have a biggie. I don't have a lot of the rock pops. I have a few, um, but I definitely don't have this one, which is cool. So, yeah, this one was part of the two. There was this one and biggie with a crown. Okay, so, again, I'm not sure what the value on this one is. It might be really good. might not be. I have no idea. So, I know that they've recently come out with a, a pops line where they actually have albums. They're in there with albums, which I think is really neat. So, let's take a look and see what our other one is. Again, it feels like it's in a sorter, but I don't know that. Let's take a look. We were able to pick a number when you did it. And, oh, it's not in a hard stack. It's a soft a soft protector. What did we get? Ooh, we got a, uh, a Capricorn. These are, this is from the line of um, pops from the Funko shop for Freddy Funko. And they have one for each of the things. I happen to be a Pisces. Um, but my wife is a Capricorn. So that's very cool. I'm glad that somebody was a Capricorn. Because, um, so yeah, th these were very, very popular. And of course, Freddy Funkos are always popular. So we'll get a chance to check out and see what the value was. Again, just remember, the box was a $50 box. So again, I have no idea. If it happens to be a little less than 50, I wouldn't be surprised just because so much has changed in the last how many ever months since it's been open. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do a little bit of research, find out what are our, the price of our pop, and we'll come on back. All right, welcome back. So we did a little bit of research on our various pops and found some uh, interesting values here. Um, we'll go with the ones that I purchased first, then we'll talk about our mystery box. So the first one is our Minions Pop. Uh, it's a very cool one, Fried Kevin. I do have some of the other ones too. I believe I have uh, Franken Bob and I have Creature Mel. The only one I don't have is Mummy Stewart so, to complete the collection. So, um, But anyway, so this one is going for $6. So it's a very basic pop. I know I paid more than this, but again, it is very, very cool. So I do like that one. Um, now, as far as our Maleficent uh, Villains uh, pop, it is a very cool one. I really do like it. Most likely, I will display this one out of the box. It's got a lot of really good detail um, that makes it a really cool pop. So, uh, again, stay tuned at the end to check out all of these on our spinner. Uh, it's currently going for $31, so that was a good deal. Actually, I think I paid less than that at Deep Discount. Usually, they're a little bit cheaper than most places. So, um, you might want to go ahead and check them out. I'll put the link below so if, in case you're curious on, on that. Um, as far as our mystery box, again, remember we paid $50 and we paid $10 shipping. So $60 total if you want to include shipping. Um, the first one is Notorious B.I.G. It's not going for much, which sort, sort of surprised me because it's pretty popular, but it's uh, $6. There's a lot of uh, B.I.G. pops now, so I guess I'm not that surprised. Um, and then we have our uh, Capricorn pop. Which is very cool. Again, people love Freddy Funkos. That is always worth, got some value in it. But I was surprised. It's going for $75. That is really, really awesome. Uh, I like this one a lot. I kind of wish it was Pisces for myself, but at least it's one for my wife so that we'll have something that's, you know, not just a just a random pop. It actually represents something. So I'm, I might try to hunt down Pisces since we've got Capricorn. So that was a really good one. Um, I want to thank DS Funko, and I believe he's going by Flimsy Funkos now. Uh, awesome job. I really appreciate it. Uh, he sent the thing right out, and I, I really apologize that it sat so long and got shuffled amongst my stuff. But he's a, he, he was a really nice guy, really helpful, and we had a little a, ba a lot of back and forth as far as that. So uh, go ahead and check him out. See if he's got a mystery box. If he's got another one going, I'll probably try to check him out and see if I can get one myself. Um, thank you very much for coming. If you're new to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe. Um, make sure to put post notifications out. We try to post Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays. Sometimes we'll get a little bit off for various different things. I'm planning on doing some lives coming up. Um, so, you know, the, make sure with your post notifications, you'll see what's going on with some of that. Um, we're trying to do some fun stuff. 
uh, trying to do some mystery boxes. We do com comic books. We do a lot of fun things on the channel. Um, if you have any suggestions, I'm happy to take them as well. Thank you very much for coming, and goodbye from the Bearded Barbarian.